It all began with a Hamlin lecturer showing paintings of the Prophet Muhammad in class, the move costing her her job, and now it's the aftermath, leading to calls for Hamlin University's president to step down. Faculty on campus say that they need to repair the damage done to the school's reputation, and they don't think that President Fainese Miller is the best person to do that. Fox 9's Rose Schmidt is live on campus with more. So, Rose, how did we get to this point? Well, President Fainees Miller is Hamlin's first black president, and she's been the campus's leader since 2015. But today, faculty were united in saying they no longer have faith in her. Full-time faculty members at Hamlin University say they want a new leader. At a meeting Tuesday, 86% voted to adopt this statement, asking President Dr. Fainees Miller to immediately tender her resignation. The sentiment was that President Miller is not the person right now. Um, to bring us back to where we were with our reputation. Hamlin has been at the center of international headlines for more than a month after an adjunct professor showed paintings of the Prophet Muhammad in a class last semester and lost her job. The American Association of University Professors, an institution devoted to advancing academic freedom, has launched an inquiry into this decision and is planning a campus visit next month. I think the, our association was really surprised at the overreaction to what happened in the classroom at Hamlin. Um, it's a remarkable violation of academic freedom to, to essentially fire the faculty member. After the incident happened, university leaders called the adjunct's actions Islamophobic, but have since walked back that statement. The president of Hamlin's faculty council points to that as one of the ways he feels this situation was mishandled, even calling it a crisis to Hamlin's reputation. It's just time for new leadership. There were mistakes made. Um, academic freedom is really important and at the same time preparing caring. Not just caring, but we're here to you know, help students learn. But President Miller has the support of the student who made the initial complaint about the paintings. She spoke over the weekend at an event honoring the Prophet Muhammad. Firing a president who stood up for her students, a black Muslim student, is wrong. Removing President Miller from her position will make all of us Muslim students unsafe and unvalued. The adjunct professor at the center of this debate is currently suing Hamlin University. We asked her lawyers today and they say she has no comment regarding the current calls for President Miller's resignation. Now the Board of Trustees is the only entity that could remove Miller from her job, but they could not be reached for comment today. Now meanwhile, we have been pressing the university to send us a statement from the president. So far, we have not received one. Live, Roche Schmidt, Fox 9.